I mean, I just want you guys to go in there so I can retreat, and then if you're going to get killed, I'll be, I'll be the one who said, well, I saw the blast, and uh, I'll yeah. get some views out of it. You can have people who are sort of like hiding out in camouflage gear, ghillie suits, and they're all in there, you know, you wouldn't even know they were there. Yeah. Oh. October. I've triggered a mine, I don't fuck. The booby trap. Look. Yeah. I've just pulled it, it would have triggered that one. Look. This is mad. And so it begins. This should be an interesting one, that's for sure. The aim of the day is to not be shot by the military. I mean, that's. You heard be, it here first. That should be the aim of every day, really. Well, yeah, but it's not every day you walk into a mine and find the military. It's not every day you walk into a facility and find the military. But today's the day we walk onto a facility and find the military. I kind of hope they shoot me. What's all these signs over here? Well, see, there's a white pole back there. And the white pole doesn't have a red flag on it. Right, okay. Which normally means that they're not firing. So... That's a good thing. Yeah, no gunfire is a uh, pretty good thing. What, yeah. what are these signs here? Military training, they trenches and things keep out. Right, okay. Those are so you don't drive tanks up there. Um, you can have people who are sort of like hiding out in camouflage gear, ghillie suits, and they're all in there, you know, you wouldn't even know they were there. Uh, but training. to be honest, they don't, they, they don't want to show themselves. If they are there, you don't see them. I've driven, I've literally driven up to like a load of trees, got out with a dog, and I'm walking around, and all of a sudden, like that, in the darkness, it goes like that. And there's, a, there's light, and there's a tent, and they've got radios and satellite dishes really? in there. And I went, whoa. I said, I never knew you were there. He goes, no, nah, we're pretty good at what we do. And I'm like, <laughs> really? I said, can I have a look? He goes, you can't come in. And I was like, Whoa, it was all like subdued light, and it was all quiet, and there was no noise, and it was just like a load of people working in there, and they were just right That's by cool. a tent, and it's like, so, <laughs> no noise, no you, light. And, uh, you know, you see them sometimes, I mean, you can come down here and you'll have 30 tanks will come past you, just all nose to tail. Oh, is that, is that it up ahead? That's it, yeah. So, oh, this is a, a, yeah. a, a village? This is a mock, like, Ukrainian or German village, it's like... They thought it was going to kick off in Serbia, so they, they kicked, they, they made this place and they made it look like the, the types of places you would have in that country, so they've got the tall right, yeah, rooms yeah. for the snow yeah, and... It looks really European, like yeah. Slavic. No, the thing to do really is to sort right, of sit don't, here... Don't see anyone. No, I'm just going to have a quick scan. Right, you got your binoculars, got okay. binoculars. Okay. Now, see, over there's a compound, and it looks like it's got a, a thing sticking up above it, like a guard post. Yeah. You see it? Yeah, I see it. To the right of that, there are vehicles in there. Now, I don't know whether that means that there's the army are in that bit. I doubt it, to be honest. I think they've just dumped those vehicles there. So, it, obviously, it, they, they have live fire exercises inside the... They do have live fire exercise on the plane, but I don't think they use live bullets inside someone. They'd be blank them more. Because, because we're, not, yeah. we're, we're not at risk of a mortar just... I just want to say, no. you do look quite suspect with your binoculars, or... Well, if we're inside a car... We, I mean, you, I don't know, we look like Russian spies, almost. I'll be honest, whenever we're filming with Matt, I feel like it's a secret agent. Yeah, no, I do, I do. 
I mean, I just want you guys to go in there so I can retreat, and then if you're going to get killed, I'll be, I'll be the one who said, "Well, I saw the blast, and uh, I'll yeah. get some views out of it." Do I just please make a yeah. make like some really nice, you know, poetic music with images of those lot having fun, you know, and yeah, uh, like violin music, you know, like yeah, yeah. And, yeah. Sell T-shirts with all three of our faces on, you know. Remembrance T-shirts and pictures of fudge. Fudge, yeah, yeah. Pictures of fudge. We've got to yeah. set up a GoFundMe for fudge, though. Yeah. GoFundMe for fudge. <laughs> all right, as, as you know, poetic as all that sounds, the mission is actually not to die over here. I tell you what, Andrew. What? The rain stopped as well, so I can fire the drone. Look how beautiful it's looking out here. Mm, I know. It's the weather is, um, is is weird, but do you know what I would say? Do what you got to do. Fly the drone afterwards because yeah, okay. if you take it off in there now, there is a security guard, one security guard, but he's on the opposite side Night of the tours. base. Yeah, well, you know, I was going to tell you, <laughs> um, but he's on the opposite side of the base and he doesn't come into the base, he's just on the gates. Right, okay. And he's there to just shoot people off if they come. Shoot people off? Shoot. Oh, shoot. <laughs> shoot. He's just there yeah. to shoot the people that come in. Yeah, yeah. As long as we're not oh, yeah, they shoot everyone who comes. Trespassers will be shot, survivors yeah. will be shot again. <laughs> yeah. Right. Now, technically, right, right, I'm not supposed to go beyond this line because I've been told not to come here again. Right. So, it's like Area 51. If I cross this line, this invisible line, yeah. right, then I'm being naughty. So, I'm going to have to drop you here so I don't get the police come around my house and go, oh, well, we did tell you, Mr. Williams. So, if I drop you here, here, I've been told by a police officer, they can't do me. Well, that's smart because right. otherwise it's an aggravating factor. I do not want to do any aggravated trespass. Right, so okay. I'm on this bit. Now, I'm not going up there. Right. And basically, if you walk around this this bend, go past those um, things, right up to the where the gates are. Yep. You see it's got razor wire on it, right? Yep. Walk around to the left side of it and round, and then you can walk over the razor wire because it's all pressed down to the ground. Right, okay, right, so, we'll do it. Yeah. Right, we'll just go on right. straight away. And, oh, and, and by the way, those best the best houses with the tunnels where you go in and you can crawl down and you crawl underneath the floor and then you come up to a hatch and shit like that and they're really cool. All those houses are down there on this rightest hand side. Right, okay. So when you go in, go immediately across to that right hand side, go in the houses and look in the basements and look for holes and look for hatches and covers, yeah? Okay. Because there's place places to go and have a look. It's right. good. Right, yeah, let me grab my stuff. Thank you, we'll do. Right, so Matthew's leaving us. Um, we are going on this mission, just the two of us. Who? Has he? Has he? Okay. I wonder if this is where he drove, where they were racing round that village um, and there was bombs going off. I don't know if you saw that episode of Top Gear. I think I have. I also saw. I was wondering if this is the one with that mock hospital too. Oh yeah, the one where they built the ambulances yeah, yeah, yeah. and had to get the patient there fast. And... I wonder if that is this place. If anyone does know, seen Top Gear, let me know if this is the place. We should probably speed walk. Are those train Yeah, I think so. No. Alright, we got to turn. Alright, let's go home. Dangerous military activity. That is concerning. Imagine, like, all of a sudden we're walking through and it's like the gate's open. Hi, the gate's open. I don't hear any gunfire. Take right, the gate is open. This is cool. Hi, hi. I've triggered a mine at uh, the booby trap. Look. You tripped a booby trap? Yeah. I've just pulled it, it would have triggered an alarm. Look. Oh, great, it's thundering. Oh, yeah, there are booby traps in the ground. Yeah, watch out. Look at these. Problem is, I've just triggered one, so they know we're here. It's too late. We're in too deep. We have to just make the move. It's okay. I think it's just them blowing short. Is 
very popular one. Yeah. Strangely. This is mad. The window's open around the corner. Number 32 then? Yeah, 32. shot blank yeah so there's no projectile on the end right so that's good it wasn't a real bullet it's a blank firing again blank shot blank We are one of the best militaries in the world for a reason. Just for military purposes, these. They were never functional. Never functional buildings. Only built for training. The outside, I think, is going to look better because it's more apocalyptic. You've got the Smash cars, the actual streets, the signs. I saw the building over there, it says fresh coal. Let me, let me catch my breath. I'm getting really excited, so I'm out of breath. I'm nervous too. I'm just wondering, them cars over there, they look new to you. Oh, yeah. Sneak around that way. There's a blast hole in the wall. That fence. It's the galvanized steel fence there. Uh, banging. Right, for the next blast hole. Go, go. Right, hold on, hold on. I see a big camera set up over there. Pointing oh, yeah. towards the cars. Keep your wits about you. Your eyes peeled. That is going to be an active side. That's, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's normal cars. Are you sure it's not someone on site? Bro, I don't know. What's that place? It's tank, oh, it's a tank. Wait, shh. I heard gunshots. Did you? Yeah. From dis very dis like way in the distance. Holy crap, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Dude, that's scary. He's, he's stood there, quick, get him. He's stood there. He's stood there. He's in his hole. I saw him. We're gonna have to hop over this bee. Alright. Stop. Just stay low. Fire for a minute. Don't 
don't go, don't be visible about me on that wall. I tell you what, this would be a perfect ground for <coughs> beginner explorers for training. There's so many ways we can escape and hide and shit. I know. I think that's it. That's the bottom's jammed. Towards the fire station. Right. Somewhere that way. Right, let's take a minute. We need to head towards the fire station. Apparently that's the crown jewel of this place. Gotta get that man said. We're gonna make our way, scurry through the bush, try and avoid any kind of slight life of signs of life. Signs of life. And then uh, get some crown jewel. We're avoiding the aliens, everybody. Yeah. This is uh ground zero for the battle humanity versus silicon-based life forms from another planet. Gotta no fuck it. We should we should dart that way. Going that way, there's some industrial stuff going on. Now maybe that is part of the mock village as well to represent an industrial battleground, I don't know. But I think we should dart this way. Let's go. Just watch out. No, we're all good, we're all good. <laughs> it was like a fairy. Can you see him? Yeah, come on. We're in view of the security hole down there. Yeah, but Andrew, keep your wits about you at all times. Just imagine, you get caught, you die. Hey look, it's like your old Peugeot. Time to leave. It's time to leave. He didn't see us. I don't know. If he didn't see us, he's not been trained right. Chances are he probably saw us, he just grew it radio through to the screen and just said, There's a couple of lads on here. Listen. I didn't see no sign that keep it up. I'm going to say. There... Let's go over here. Did he? He didn't see us. He was smoking. Bro, he was smoking. Bro, bro. We're walking right into where the train is. You really want to do this? Yeah. Give Matt a ring. He's, he wasn't. He wasn't in his civvies. He wasn't in. He was wearing a full face. Exactly. He, exactly. He was training. Hello. Hey, Matt. 
Uh, Dan's dead. No. No, 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 no. Actually, I know, I know. A actually, bro, um, we literally just walked up to a soldier. Um, we were about maybe 20 yards from him. He looked right at us and didn't see us. But he was looking right at us. So now we're hiding at the moment. And we don't know if we should continue. What are the odds of us being shot being here? Nil. He doesn't think we'll get killed. So I said, let's just do it till we get caught. What, 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 ask him what the, 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 the army will do. Yeah, like, what will the army do if they catch us? Just say we didn't see the sign. And they'll just kick us off. Really? There was no red flag flying, though. No. I did hear gunshots before, though. You know what this means, Dan? What? Mission Impossible continues. Let's go. Oh, no. All right, uh, now we'll call you soon. We're just going to run around the board and we'll call you. Go ahead. All right. We'll call you soon, buddy. Oh, yeah, that's funny. All right. All right, talk to you soon. Bye. Dude, just come on. Wait. Andrew. I need to think about this. What? Right. Let's just work out where we're going to head first. Right. I was thinking go there, down that street. You do realise, right, because because they've got blank fire and guns, you do realise that they probably will aim and shoot at us just to scare us. Okay. So if they do, just be warned, they're not real bullets, right? It's still scary. They are not, yeah, I know, it's going to be scary, but just, just keep that in mind, they will not shoot real bullets at us. Let's just go. Bro, seriously? Andrew, we are... <laughs> we are pushing our luck with this one. Yeah. Well, some days I just don't care. Wait. Oh, yeah. To the right. To the right. Security office. Yeah, but we need to keep an eye on this security. You do realise we're going to walk into one of the buildings and there's going to be a, a military guy crouched down, like, hiding. I'm just waiting for them to just send all the lights out what's on the streets. I mean, I'm, I'm quite happy with exploring the place, but what I'm not happy with is disrupting their training. That's what I don't want to do. I think we're OK. Yeah, but I'm not, I don't want to... Even if we disrupt them for an hour, that's an hour that they've not been training for, which I, I want to try and avoid. First of all, we need to look to see where the military is. Somebody there. Oh, shh. When you're looking, right, don't look at the obvious. When you're looking, make sure you're looking at the bushes. And then the bullet just... Just, just, just because they don't, they're not going to stand in plain sight if they're looking for us. Right, they'll, so they'll just wait in a bush for us to walk past and grab you. You be quiet for the one that I don't know if it has sound. Well, looks like it's got missiles attached to the side of it. I think it's going to be infrared and maybe speakers, maybe, I don't know. Naffy there, there's a microwave in there. It's pointing upwards. It's not even pointing. It's pointing at us. Yeah, it's not even in use. Right, watch out. There's a petrol station down there. Now there is a big ball camera on top of the, that building over there.
There's a generator, it's not running over there. Let's just chill for a minute. Just chill. I know how soon get fed into that. At least we're away from everyone. So we have for the petrol station. Yeah, I don't think that's going to be No, is that me? He's pointing. Oh. Oh. Uh. Hi. Just want to speak to you, ask you why you're taking uh, pictures. Uh, we didn't realise where anyone was here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys are. Uh, we just fil we, we filmed, we yeah, we thought it was an abandoned village. <laughs> we didn't even realise you guys were here. Uh, okay, no, no, no. <laughs> you're gonna give me a heart attack. <laughs> no, we, we, we told you guys are part of the training. So. No, 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 we're not. No, we're not part of any yeah, training. Yeah, oh, shit. No worries, no worries. All right. okay if we look around. Um, I, there's, a, there's gonna be a lot of fire in today. Yeah, 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 let's so get, we should probably get off here. A lot of fire today. Well, yeah. not, not live fire. Not live fire, fire no, it is all blanks, but we've got enemy in some of these buildings. Um, right, yeah, we should get off. Um, this is a military camp. Right, okay. Yeah, we I thought it was an abandoned mock village. Yeah. No, no, it's, it's, it's a military camp. Right, okay, right, well, sorry about that. No, 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 it's fine, mate. Right. Right. right, how do we get off here without getting, uh, <laughs> without getting shot out? Oh, no, you, you, you'll you'll be be right. no one's going to shoot you like this. Uh, which, which way do you guys come in from? Uh, we came from just over the fields over there. The gate is wide open, too, you notice. Oh, yeah, that's because of our fucking vehicles. We love tanks and all that coming through. Right, okay, right. I bet you had a bad shock. I mean, it would have made an interesting video, but I'd have run for my life, yeah. Oh, right, so no, just no, go out no, the way we came. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's probably best through the moment if it's training. Right, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. We don't want to disrupt training. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, right, sorry right. about that, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you too. Okay, yeah, we'll call it. That could have been... Uh, Imagine if you'd have walked through the building or something like that. That's what I was thinking of. That was cool. That was one of the coolest experiences I've had in a while. Yeah, I mean, definitely, uh, it was that way. I oh, know it wasn't, it was that way. Yeah. It, um, definitely beat a normal abandoned house, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. I wonder if we can get permission to come on here when they're not training. Yeah, they seem like they would have been alright, wouldn't they? Yeah, you probably should. Uh, it's the guy that didn't catch us earlier. Oh, yeah. You want to film the conversation with him? Hey, go on. hey, hey we got caught. Yeah. yeah, we got surrounded by four, four military guys with uh, machine guns. Yeah. No, they were no, they were they were really cool actually. Yeah, they only shot me twice. They time. actually uh, they thought we were part of the training program. Yeah, bro, they told us that in some of the buildings there was like enemy guys, so we could have been walking around and stumble across like soldiers inside the buildings. Well, enemies. Enemy soldiers in the buildings, like you know. Oh anyway, we're heading back to the road if you want to come get us. Yeah, okay, I'll, I'll get up in two minutes. Yeah. All right, in a bit. Bye. Right. Oh, there's a helicopter there, yeah. In a playground? Yeah, helicopter in the playground. That's pretty cool. Uh, we're just walking out the front gate. Yeah. Pretty sure this is the way. Wait, hold on, hold on before we go. If you want to get a TikTok or an Instagram story, now is the time to do it. No, I'm all right. Oh, you don't bring your phone, did you? We should probably get out of here though, these are trenches. Uh, well, today we are at a uh, mock village.
mean, we could have played along and said, we're civilians. Yeah, we're civilians. We're meant to be here. We saw, we saw the guys over there. They're taking, they're taking the petrol station hostage. <laughs> <laughs> and they'll run over there. Well, okay, Matthew, yeah. that was interesting. You shocked me, man. <laughs> that <laughs> shocked me with that. I've that been, was interesting. There's never been anybody in there every time I've, oh, I've ever it's, gone it's there. Still, still good Bro, we was on there and we saw a guy in, in, uh, in uniform, right? He didn't see us. He was smoking. We think anyway. Yeah. And then, so I was like, listen, we need to hide out for a little bit. We snuck around for a bit longer and then we stood by some uh, wall and we were debating whether to make a run for the petrol station. Yeah. <laughs> Next minute, four guys. Did you, need, did you need to fill up then? What? <laughs> did you need to fill up? Yeah, I think, I think, to fill up, yeah. Yeah. I think they had GPs, but blanks. So, um, but they were laughing. <laughs> they found it funny because they looked, they looked at us, they thought we were part of the training exercise. <laughs> they, they were like, they were like, stop there, can we ask what you're doing here? And, uh, <laughs> And I think one of them twigged it. There were cameras, and he was smiling, right? <laughs> and uh, he was like, you, "You're not part of the, the program, are you?" I was like, "No." The telly program. Yeah. I was like, "We thought this was an abandoned mock village." He was like, "No, this is definitely not abandoned. We're currently training here." Um, but no, they were cool. They were like, they, when they realised they were about to walk off, and Andrew was like, do you, "Should we leave, or do you mind? Do you mind us?" He was like. To be honest, we wouldn't advise sticking around because there is firing going on today. Um, <laughs> and he was alright, but he said the blanks. Oh, that's but, right. but, and then he also told us yeah, like, we could be walking around, but they had like terrorists hiding out somewhere. In the buildings. Place. So they we didn't even know. We could have walked in. Yeah, we could have walked in and been a, a guy sat there dressed as like a Taliban soldier or something. Oh, I tell you what, it'd been classic if you'd gone through one of those tunnels and like opened a little hatch and like you're in a room of terrorists. No, because they, they just <laughs> shot blanks off at us. Could you imagine that? Oh boy, that would have been something. Yeah, no. I think you've had the the full experience there. Then. Well, you've had a good one because well, we you've got an exclusive around. there that nobody else has got. Because every time we've gone there, we've gone around there. There's never been anybody in there. Really? Mm. Oh, we we were running around as if we were in military training. We were yeah. hiding behind things. We were trying to like dodge the cameras. But well, we saw we, we saw the security. Right into, uh, yeah, we walked right into a soldier. He didn't even recognize, like, notice us. He just stood there, completely in his own world. And we're like, the head's just like, yo, come here, come here. The guy's looking right at us. It's like, I don't think he's, he has I mean, seen us yet. I don't know if he saw us or not. I don't know. But what I will say is. Those guys are cool as hell. Um, and what I will be doing is in the link in the description, there will be a link for the charity Health Heroes. So if you do want to go over and donate, please feel free uh, to go over and donate some money towards Health Heroes. So, so one of the things he did say is he said, uh, he was like, you're not part of the program, are you? And he was like, no. Now, because he saw our cameras, one of them was kind of laughing. He might have assumed he knew what we, what we did. Now, yeah, I probably assumed he knew what we did. But the rest of them, uh, they were looking at us. And my theory is they thought we were press, actors uh, press. Because don't forget, when they're training, especially in uh, urban, combat like, urban combat like that, they've got to decipher who's a terrorist, who's a threat, who's a civilian, who's who's innocent, you know, uh, whether you're a neutral party there, like a press. Now, we're stood there with cameras. He thought my fault that we were press, um, you know, acting press. So that's why he approached us. But then when he realised we weren't, he was just kind of like, they're all, they're all laughing. Uh, yeah, I mean, that looked like it could have been a good day out. <laughs> I, I reckon if I'm we'd jealous have, now. I reckon jealous. if we'd have spoke to him, I reckon they'd have been like, I'll tell you what, lads, yeah, you go off and do what you want because it might have had a bit more training to their training, mm. you know, having a couple of real life civilians in there. See, they failed there. Do you know why those guys failed? Because you were actually terrorists. Oh, there's a helicopter coming in. Oh, yeah. You were actually terrorists. Dressed up as journalists, oh. and they let you through. Plot twist! <laughs> plot twist! Have you heard this, Andrew? There's a plot twist going on. So they could have thought we were journalists, but could we have been terrorists dressed as journalists or dressed as uh, civilians, and then they just let us go out, really interrogating us? Dun, dun, well, dun, dun. Oh, not, I, it was all—it would have all been make believe anyway. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. But yeah, you know, they could have. Just Interesting. Cam Everyone gets wowed by a camera, you see. Yeah. So if you walk up with a camera and act like you're the press, they're going to go, oh, yeah, yeah, that's all right, mate. And it's like, they could ask, start asking them questions. How are you doing today then, boys? And then you go, right then, and pull a gun out. And so like, yeah, got well, you. Got that's, you. That's something the military can maybe take on board and maybe mm. add a couple of actors like that inside the sets, um, inside the mock villages. So that, yeah, so that they can get a feel for, you know, deception and stuff like that as well. <laughs> they probably already planned for all that. That might not have been part of the programme today, but yeah, definitely cool. 
Right, so because there is now a helicopter flying around, um, it would be ridiculous to me uh, to fly the drone. So Matthew Williams, aka the Secret Vault, is going to let me borrow his drone footage. So yeah, big shout out to Matthew Williams for that one. So Matthew Williams just drops us off, but look at the state. There is a storm brewing, bro. Oh, it is coming. So um, we should probably head on the ground or something. We shouldn't. I mean, Matthew wants to take us down that abandoned pier, uh, Western Supermare. That'd be sick. Yeah, but. Bro, only last week uh, a little boy um, near where I live died from getting struck by lightning. Really? Yeah, it was all over the news, yeah, it's such a shame, but he was just playing football and got struck by lightning, so, um, you know, although, and I mean although, I absolutely love thunder and lightning, it is not something to be messed around with, um, and you never know, you know, it could strike. So, and heading out towards sea, walking down that pier, the thunder, uh, I'm, I'll take a pass on that one for now, just out of respect for uh, for my own life and. Okay. But. Bro, it's twisting. You yeah, I see the twist. It's twisting. It's the hot and the cold. I mean, we're lucky in England we don't get tornadoes. Um, actually, actually, Andrew, you do realise we are one of the most. Um, we we get one of the. We get some of the highest um, numbers on micro tornadoes in, like the, in, in the world, yeah. So, I remember reading it years ago, UK has the highest number of micro tornadoes in the world. Oh, that one is wanting, that one right there is wanting to turn into a fun, I can tell. We've, we've had some really bad tornadoes in the past, it's right through, uh, I think there's one in Blackpool once, or somewhere. You know what I've always wanted to do, bro? Right. Storm chasing. Yeah, that would be sick, actually. But storm chasing. You're better off going to America to that. Yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah. Always wanted to storm chase. So cool. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that video. Uh, big shout out to Matthew Williams, aka The Secret Vault. Just saw the big bolt. And I know. AKA The Secret Vault for taking us down and nearly getting us shot. I uh, love that guy to bits, but he definitely wants to get us killed at some point. Uh, also, we don't know what we're actually doing next, but stay tuned. It's going to be a banging video anyway. You already know how it is on the trip, on the road. Um, and I do want to say as well, call. 